So now stars have cool stuff around them, like rocks, ice, and piece of garbage, which can make some very interesting things. Like this ball of flaming rocks, for example. Holy shit, we just got hit with another ball of flaming rocks. And it kind of made a mess. Which is now a piece of garbage. Weather update, it's raining rocks from outer space. Weather update, those rocks might have had water inside them and now there's hot steam in the sky. Weather update, cooler temperatures today and the floor is no longer lava. Weather update, it's raining. Severe flooding alert, the entire world is now a piece of garbage. Volcano alert. Bad piece of garbage. There's nothing in the ocean. What? Something's alive in the ocean. Oh cool, like a plant piece of garbage. No, a microscopic speck. It lives at the bottom of the ocean and eats piece of garbage. Which is being served hot and fresh, made from gnarly space ingredients left over from when it was raining rocks or whatever. Oh yeah, and it can do that. It has secret instructions written inside itself telling it how to build a piece of garbage. So that's pretty nifty, I would say. Tired of living at the bottom of the ocean? Now you can eat piece of garbage. Using a revolutionary technique, you can convert a piece of garbage to food. Taste the sun. Side effect, now there's oxygen everywhere and the sky's blue. Then the earth might have been a piece of garbage for a while, maybe even a couple of times. It's a sponge. It's a plant. It's a piece of garbage. And some other types of weird strange water bugs and strange fish. It's the Cambrian explosion. Wow, that's animals and stuff. But we're still in the ocean. Hey, can we go on land? No. Why? The sun is a deadly laser. Oh, okay. Not anymore, there's a piece of garbage. Now the animals can go on land. Come on, animals, let's go on land. Nope, can't walk yet. And there's no food yet, so I don't care. Okay, will you learn to walk if there's a piece of garbage? Up here? Maybe, said some bugs. And fish. 